Hi. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, when I'm holding my hand as a bag, and it's not my purse. My purse is only slightly larger than this. But this is for all of the money that you were supposed to give our feature, and I'm going to start it off with this, and I'm going to start passing it around and torturing everyone with it. Well, we have a phenomenal, phenomenal feature this evening. Ladies and gentlemen, please give it up for the man who ran this thing for him how many years. Give it up for Mr. Charlie Newman! Okay, Gore Vidal died. Yeah. The average IQ of the country dropped 17 points. <laughs> Headline in today's paper, Obama signs secret paper supporting um, the, uh, yeah, those guys in Syria. The freedom fighters. It's a secret paper and everyone knows it's in the paper. Okay. Um, Let's not do applause, because time is short. We'll just not do it. Kaiser Sose says things never change by themselves. If so, resign yourself, alter your course, replace nouns with verbs, subjects with objects, without which evening hours grow hungry. It's no thing but ups, downs, highs, lows, for better, for worse, for given, for reasons you will never understand. And all this self-centered routine to sign up for, you chose this. Kaiser Sose says, our Father who art in heaven grumbles gibberish. Kaiser Sose evades no thing, humanity, done in, in heaven as it is on earth, never gets its vitamins, antioxidants, step aerobics, cosmetic enhancements, excuses, regrets, or its swaggering frailties, but hey, no matter amidst the sprinkling of withouts, the withins are what get you, the gray hair that haunts you in the mirror, no room for amnesty, and even your minutes grow old. Kaiser Sose says, grind positives into negatives into a life of phlegm. Excessive hangover logic may be just the natural selection your delusion needs. The cabal of South sociobiologists smooth all the speed bumps that keep the mayhem hidden for now. It is useless, of course. Assess, enjoy a cheroot, and remember, Kaiser Sose says, ignore the capillary fine line between love and obsession. No applause. No applause. Sorry. Sorry. No applause. Yeah, right. No applause. The dead never rise. Never get nervous. Never do the splits. Hardcore truth is all the dead have. I say to anyone who will listen, expecting to become rich and powerful on God's say so, trapped in a gutter of space with a whore and a cheat and a murderer in rat love on a mission of blindness, deafness, lameness of the heart. I know the routine and come dressed in the most fashionable ennui because. Face it, the sin is in looking bad doing the things you do. Each thing, everything, ended, eyed, eaten, effect, no thing not hinged in the social. After all, every seventh heed, as, yeah, right. after, after all, every seventh heathen aspiration is an eight ball albatross around somebody's beautiful neck in the expectation of cookie tombstones and flies of the cannot unopen, rebroken, behold the infinite kind to be rebuilt on the few glitzy baubles donated by directors of chance with a once in a lifetime unwritten double your money back guarantee. Daily agenda angels ash can the rag summer of your content even as your poet runs out of recycled back alley adios verbiage. Seriously, would you rise for this? <laughs> <laughs> you elect blindness and failure all at once and once and for all and you believe in fume parades and more or less in bone people becoming an avalanche on our shores in doe-eyed intercourse and you vote religiously with delight with power how free you must feel in sight outsourced regarding life only until it has time to stand in line Take a number, one with a bullet, too brutal. The romance is lost on me. Snuff to snuff, how are you different from us? You are clay after all, unless God made you China. Too fragile for everyday use. 
Everybody casts somebody old because everybody can, but not me. I have dark teeth, I joke, I develop the kids in me. Beat that. Convince yourself you're cast fine. You're fine, fine. And then it's my turn. Eventually, I will expose your rickets, eventually. You won't even mind. You will glow like an old joke, extending everything with the very flippin' thing, every conversation, every tooth, every spring, every Cleopatra cast your way. Me? I don't Cleopatra much. I like the knowns, the mattress mornings, the always young spring actresses, everybody meets and greets in the streets. See, it's just that way. I war, I want, I won't, I will conversate powerful negative well thought, then broken and dark until Cleopatra's rickets have children. Hey, I spring like nobody, sister. I'm philosophy. Dig? I'm slowby, everything grimness but hip. I party of one, and you? Shit, you ain't invited. <laughs> Yeah. yeah. I'm poet. Rapper? No, I ain't. I cast no mattress and children don't hear me. Roll two and see, unless you're out of practice. Now, unless you're chicken. See, everything me, even my eventually, hear my glow, my spells, my mattress stories of who likes to do what in the dark, and of you. Of course, there is you. Touch my rickets. Everything will be cast away, and I want it all. New, used, recycled, broken, repaired, garbage. This hunger for everything must lead to war eventually. But hey, I'm game. I've got the grimness in me, or else no winter spark, no after spring, no grimness. Been everything, everywhere, every which way, but under the spell. Truth is, I'm velour broke, no lie. A multiplex philosophy in a Colosseum universe. Like I was born to be broke, an endless deception everybody buys into. Even if I'm a day old and don't glow no more, trust me, I'm no worse than the guy you're sitting next to. Mm -hmm. That happens like that. Okay. I'm, uh, I'm cast adjacent to fear and broke rhymes, and then I am teeth to be cast as everything. Maybe some spells are iffy, but my spells, they ain't kidding around long to be dark and slow and hear the glow, but hey, I ain't got no records on me. Everything is, something is, nothing ain't got no spark, but everybody likes things cast with spark, with real acceptance, still glowing in velour light. I am cast joined at the asshole to cherubim and a stray broke and broken, and everything means war, every time, everywhere, everybody. Knocked down is game to change to rickets from spring. Everyone cast won't trust the dark joke behind your situation. After I convince them I am the new man, high on wants and the tombs of spells. But change is the beginning. Fine. I can split again. I can be new, but I can not be down on change. Not if I want to be cast to be everything I am not. War must be practiced. I must practice. And then I will be cast in sly teeth or naked on the Serengeti. Retreat is not an option. Stupid is not an option. You must know one thing, but nobody's talking. Bodies buried, thanks to God. Happen next week, wearing dead falling images, existential valleys kiss my ass. A dirty brain flooding my very private galleries, explorative sallies into the last nerve, reciprocating tallies do unto others, every little chunk in place. You need to believe what will happen last night. Words in ice lock up a year in the cheat seeps. Ought to be more, nowhere, nothing to see. Now, here, nobody to know. Damn it, where are the bodies? In some squalid room, everywhere, every time. Smiling around with the boys, eating secrets through a haze like they're Roy oysters. That must be raw oysters. You know, this not clapping thing is killing us. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm going to get through this. Did somebody say unknowable? Caught in a vacuum of gullible thin king? Stadiums hail hometown mud packs and plant whiskey in hollow circles and circle like beasts waiting for summer and slouch toward hidden Bethlehem where trials never underestimate the power of ne negative thin king? Not every Hegelian fascist has the had the pleasure of cocktails between a knowing master and a positive cloud of clues. I am not pinstriped, I think. I am historic, a plume of dinosaur gas. Even a learned carbon footprint crawls its hasty final minutes across country machinery, and every cloud that passes tells the world I may speak in tongues, but I speak straight. 
And still, angel songs go on and on, aided and abetted by sooty candle after sooty candle, lit to God's suffering. I would whisk the world and outline and the tongues and the stacks of angels and dinosaur dust. I would drink carbon cocktails between footprints. I would swallow cities and scatter birds beyond when cities collapse forever. But I underestimate my nowhere, my now here, my power of negative living. God bless the thin game wherever the fuck he is. <laughs> oh, that sucks. <laughs> hey, we're down to two. Uh-oh. I did it. Wait, but they're in the wrong order. Okay. Yeah, I'm Newark. The express lane to tabloid TV where my ass belongs. I'm stuck in neutral, watching those who aren't, those who never disappeared in my rearview mirror, who aren't with the words it takes to describe them. It all comes down to deserving it or not. I coin my nightshade eyes, court those who smile while I take pictures of those who do and those who don't, pray like fascists in the mirrors of their discontinent. The prom crawl queen of all virtues, sucking the pornographer's bloody fingers, sitting on the laps of the rich and the famous, no matter that it comes from friends with the best intentions. I axe grind the sucker's dull, donate a beautiful night sweat for a platoon serving make-believe final meal. One last attempt to return to absolute power. It is useless, of course. I am where the bodies are buried. They are the bodies. The last poem to my wonderful New York. I got rickets, I got a split, I glow like velour in the dark. My teeth are all broke, but I ain't no joke. No, I am the grimness of Newark. My children cast a war of spells, they all got their old man's spark. I'm old, but I'm hip, I gave them my chip. Yeah, I am the grimness of Newark. The grimness of Newark, the grimness of Newark. The king does the queen on the throne. The grimness of Newark, the grimness of Newark. Nobody can leave me alone. I don't chew nothing a hundred times, I eat just like I'm a shark. Much as I crave cake, I prefer raw steak. Yes, I am the grimness of Newark. The grimness of Newark, the grimness of Newark. I am what I am, don't you see? The grimness of Newark, the grimness of Newark. Everybody wants to be me. Jump down, turn around, pick a bell, if that's how you get your high marks. But jumping's for fools who stutter and drool. Listen up, I'm the grimness of Newark. Thank you. Oh, he's going to leave the stage. That wasn't loud enough. Please give it up one more time. For Mr. He gets a phone call. Right when he's finishing his show, he's like, sorry, I've got to go. Scary, got my phone call. Yes, I'm the Griffiths of New York. <laughs> <laughs> yes, the Griffiths of Newark. So please, Keep in mind, ladies and gentlemen, because this lady just decided, because she is stuck with work, I'm sure, shut up really, really late, Robin Fine. She's going to be our feature in two weeks. Yeah. All right. Yeah, on the 15th. Yeah, so I want everybody to be here for that. And guess what, Mr. Bob Lawrence? This is a three Wednesday month in August. Mr. Bob Lawrence, our feature on August 29th. Awesome, awesome, awesome. you to be able to check out the schedule at chaoticarts.org slash about cafe. You can also find about YouTube clips for the video for the open mic as well as the feature and we're going to have podcasts for them both as well. And I thank you all so much.